Hey everybody, my name is Manlios. I don't really know what to say. I'm going to be playing Penumbra. That's really the most important thing. Penumbra Overture, as you can see on the screen here. It's a scary game. I was told I should play it. I never played this game before. Well, I lied. I'm sorry. I played a little bit of it just to make sure it didn't blow up on my computer. And you know, it seems like it doesn't. So, we're going to continue with this. And we're going to see what happens. I'm sorry if I get too scared. I'm really good at getting scared. But I'm also really good at, uh, at just being scared. So, uh, let's do this. I, uh, I, I skipped the really long intro. I'm sorry. I just, it's, it's really long. It's just talking about him and his dad. And something about a bank box and coming to there. We're on a boat. And we need to go pick up some items. So let's pick up some items. We got a map here. We don't need a map, though. Now, a trusty bottle of Jack. Jack Annuals. Jake Annuals, actually. Whoops. I'm an angry drunk. I'm sorry. I can't help it sometimes. We got our book. Use that. That's like a quest book. I mean, it tells us stuff that we need to know. It helps us get through things. Um. We got a flashlight. Because, like all scary games, you need a flashlight. Because it's dark. Oh. That was me losing control of my mouse. And I apologize. But, uh, we also need the locker. We need, well, we don't need the locker. We need what's in the locker. And you're asking me what's in the locker. It's a, it's a secret. Are you ready? It's a glow stick. And a very, a very nice picture. Some dogs. So we get the glow stick. Use that with G. It's like a backup flashlight. It's not as good, but it'll work. And we got some batteries. And judging by the horn, I believe it's time to continue our adventure off this boat. Because no one wants to be on a boat. As you see, he stepped off the boat, starting on the blizzard, formed around me. Realizing how utterly devoted I had been to discovering my father's past, I had no idea what to expect. Soon enough, my concerns were justified. I don't know whether I lost my orientation or my spirit first, but I lost feeling in my extremity soon after, and I know hypothermia was setting in. I started looking for shelter. This is where we. This is where we take place. This is it. This is the ice worlds. We're in the snow. I think in. I don't know where it's the snow, but let's just say Antarctica for now, because it's cold in Antarctica, and this kind of looks cold. So, we need to get shelter. There's not a lot of shelter here. We're just in a big open area. We didn't pack enough supplies. Because, you know, we're amateurs. We weren't prepared for this lifestyle. So, what's going through? Oh, look, what's this? Ah, oh, we can't, we can't break it. Um. Now, see, do we have anything? A flashlight? No, we don't want to break our flashlight. We need to find something. It should break the ice. Ooh, what was that? Stepped in like a little pothole there. Rocks. I know how to pick up rocks, game. Jeez. Go away. That's just, I'm just throwing it because, you know, this walking takes forever. You gotta be quick. You gotta learn to be quick in this game. Because zo zombies? Maybe zombies? I don't, I don't know what we're gonna fight. It might be zombies. It might be aliens. It might just be like mutant babies that to crawl in the sailing and do little flips and stuff. Who knows? I'm sure some of you know, because I mean, I imagine some people play this game. But I don't know. Oh, I need to turn it. Let's take our time turning it. Oh, oh. Then we got it. Look at that. I don't know about you guys, but that's some of the nicer shelter I've seen. Calm down, let Oh, that didn't sound good. It sounds like we're picking up some radio chatter or something there. Do we have a radio? If we have a radio, we could just call for help. Um, well, that was actually a pretty good fall. On the metal bars, too, that had to hurt. 
Like, you don't realize it, because like, oh, it's just a video game. But that hat, like, think about it, that hurts. That doesn't tickle. Um, G for the glow stick, because we don't want to waste our flashlight batteries in here. This place is not too scary. That's locked. It's stuck. There must be something in the way. I can't do that. A flare. Oh, someone else here too. A steel rod. Hey. <laughs> steel rod. That's what it is. So, what is this? Maple syrup, I believe. And that's that's tuna. It's a hammer. I can swing it by pressing by moving my mouse. Like uh like games. A like shivery or something, I imagine. Moving my mouse. Oh yeah, see, just like it. It's alright. I I practice. I don't know why you would ever attack someone with a hammer like this, but hey, you can do it if you want to. It's all about diversity in this game. What was that? Something. Oh. Something back here. I want that. I want in there. How do we get in there? How do I? Oh, now I can move it. You gotta put the hammer away. So we only have two hands. You have to remember that. You can't. You can't. No, I need to have to go into this. You need. A, you really need to watch out what you're carrying. You can't carry a hammer and do that. I feel like I should have said a pun while I destroy that. Um, you can. You can just. Rewind of it and then pause it, well, mute it, I should say, and pretend that I said it's hammer time. That f yeah, that's a good pun. That one works. Let's jump. Oh shit, on the donkey. Well, I don't know what's down there, but no one's scary games. Something tells me we're gonna have to go down there. What is this? A box. Hole in the center, no way to operate it. A hole in the center. Oh, we have the uh the steel rod. <laughs> just we're just gonna put the steel rod in the hole. Just like that. Just turn it around a bit. What just happened? I'm not sure. Let's just do it again. Oh, it's hard to turn. Oh, that's it. Oh, look at that, it's open. I don't know. It's scary down there, isn't it? It's alright, hold on. Hold on. Oh yeah, look at this hammer now. Now we're ready. Whatever I was descending into, it was a hundred feet below ground, protected by two solid metal hatches located in a remote arctic wilderness and buried beneath the snow. I didn't know what to expect, but it made me feel something I hadn't felt since I was a child never given it much thought before, but I realized that our entire society is a network of safety nets, emergency services at the end of a phone line, health and safety, the workplace, friends, family, lovers, all there, if something goes wrong, part of a, this is a lot of read, I'm sorry, part of a carefully designed structure to prevent all but the most mundane of emotions. Once again, I felt like I did when I was in school, surrounded by a closing ring of older kids, knowing anyone that might help me. Friends, parents, teachers were too scared or too far away. That's deep. This game is deep, I guess. Oh, I'm really bad with my mouse. So they draw down something when I draw it down. There must be another way. Oh, anything. Stealth. I'm good at sneaky games. I'm. I'm I have you know that I'm actually really good at being sneaky. So, uh. This is actually the furthest I got. This is where I stopped playing, so this is all new to me. What's what's around here? We got some office. Explosives. Workshop storage. And a northern area. Is there a monster right here? Hello? Monsters? Monsters? There's nobody in here. Just 
just an abandoned mine. Storage room is this way. I, I don't know why I'm going to the storage room, I just don't know where else to go. Um, the office is that way. No, I feel like the stro- oh, well, it's not, it's just a pole. Some rocks there. Oh, that lamp, that lamp, I thought that lamp was a monster for a second. Here we go. I hope this is the right way. Is this for not? And then we're, we're, we're in a pickle. It has to be the right way. I mean, storage room is pretty storagey. It might have like something we need later on. Oh, shh. Yeah. It's just the learning screen. Um. What the hell is that? Lighter here. What the hell is going on? I just this game is no longer fun anymore. It's locked as well. Oh no. What are these things? The trap door. Hello. Oh no. Hold on. I got my hammer. Oh, I can't open doors with my hammer. That's so. Oh. That was such a good, I don't know if it was such a good idea either. Oh, I did it again. Alright. I may never get used to that. I may never either. There's, there's a lot in here. Yes. Oh. Well, it turns out the storage room was a dead end. So. I, th I think this is a good time to stop. Close the door. We don't live in a barn. So, uh, next episode, we'll, uh, we'll play some more of this. And we'll figure out what's going on. Because, oh, was this open now? No, it isn't. Right. What this one? No. Alright, so next episode, we'll, uh, we'll probably wander around some more. Like idiots. But until then, I'm in Laos. And it was very nice uh, playing this game with you. So I'll see you around.